Hey everyone, it's Grandma Scratcher here in Florida, and today the Florida Lottery tickets I've got are the $2 lottery tickets. Before we talk about it, you know I've got to say it's just for fun and entertainment purposes. I don't sell lottery tickets. Underage gambling is illegal, and if you have a gambling addiction, please seek some help. All right, um, before we talk about it, a couple of people have commented, and I've gotten some emails. I sound tired. I am. You guys, if you've never been through a hurricane, you, you can't imagine um, where we were. We were very hard hit. Um, my house got away with very minimal uh, issues, but so many people near us were very hard hit. There was flooding, houses destroyed, uh, tornadoes touched down within miles of where I lived, um, where I live, I'm sorry. And that kind of thing takes a toll on you because if you've never been through a hurricane, I'm just going to give a little bit of information. There's so much buildup, so much lead up, so much anticipation the best I can describe it is it's like waiting to get on a roller coaster ride, except longer. You know the time you're standing in line, your heart's beating, your stomach's churning, at least for me. You're anticipating it, you're anxious. That goes on for days with the hurricane. Then the hurricane finally hits and the adrenaline kicks in. We were outside in 60 mile an hour winds plus, replacing parts back on our house because we couldn't afford to let them go because if you let them go, the wind gets under and sucks your house up. Okay, so there was a lot going on. And it is extremely draining. And so then, finally, after it passes, after the next day when you go out and you have to do all the things you have to do to preserve your home after the hurricane, um, you can't just leave things alone and rest the next day. You gotta go back out, you gotta get things done and deal with people and lines at the store and can you get to the store and are the roads unpassable and do they have what you need in stock and there's other people needing the same thing. I mean, we're talking anxiety level is on point for at least a week for a hurricane before, during, after. So I'm still like in the after stages. Um, it's Sunday, you guys will get this video Monday. My husband has surgery this coming week and that's another thing. I've got upcoming things. You know, sadly life doesn't stop for, for a hurricane and it's just the anxiety just drains you. It really does. So if I sound a little bit tired, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to, it's just been a really long, last 10 days <laughs> and I've got a really long another 10 days coming up so forgive me I'm here for you guys though as I always am these are the older lottery tickets they are two dollars not the five dollar tickets the five dollar tickets came out um this year the two dollar tickets came out last year it's funny because it seems like these are so much older than that before that we had green lottery tickets but they are they are gone they have been pulled um so I guess all the top prizes are gone but not the case on these tickets there are still eight top prizes, which is $50,000 remaining. There are still 15, $10,000 remaining. So, so it's still some really good prizes to be won on these lottery tickets. Um, I have numbers, I've got five of them. Number 108, 109, 110, one, uh, sorry, my fingers are 111 and 112. I figured we hadn't played these in a while and I needed to play something a little bit less expensive due to, like I said, you know, we've got um, my husband's surgery coming up, the hurricane just hit, we've got things we gotta take care of. So we're kind of on a budget. For those of you who say, you have an addiction. No, I don't, honey. People spend more than $10 on coffee each day. So $10 spend for some fun with my friends. I get by with a little help from my friends. I get, we'll skip that part. <laughs> And then there's going to be people saying, I know, I knew it was a dab tool. <laughs> you guys, you guys are funny. I don't think you guys realize how much you make me laugh. Uh, if you've never left a comment on my channel, you really should. Because when you leave a comment down below, I reply. There's nobody else doing it. It's just me. Sometimes my husband's sitting next to me and he's laughing too with the things you guys leave me. I love the stories. I love the comments. This is not like other lottery scratcher channels. When you leave a comment or a story below, I comment back. Um, sometimes if the story's really good, I might share it. Uh, so you never know what's gonna happen. That's the moral of the story here on the channel. But feel free to leave a comment below. We're heading towards 100,000 subscribers. If you're not a subscriber yet, you really should be. If you haven't signed up for the newsletter over on GrandmaScratcher.com, which is free, you really should. Um, because there's no chance of spam. I've sent nothing out yet. <laughs> <laughs> but you should sign up for the newsletter because once we get closer to 100,000, things are going to start happening. They're going to be rolling, rolling on a river, literally, because I still have the lake in my backyard. Yeah, if you didn't check out my post-hurricane video, you should do that. It talks about the lake in my backyard. It's like all of a sudden I was upgraded to waterfront property that I didn't ask for. Um, but it's all okay. It's all good. All right, so here we go. Um, this is kind of like picture bingo, right? You scratch off, then you scratch off up top. We've got the barrel and the parrot. 
and we've got the parrot. I don't see a barrel though. We've got the flower pot and the umbrella. Ella could have used that. I don't think the umbrella would have helped, to be honest. I'm pretty sure it wouldn't have. No flower pot. We've got the tree and the moon. I knew I saw the tree somewhere. Is there a moon? No, there's a star, but no moon. Green clovers, yellow moons, blue diamonds, the arrows, and the crown. The crown. And, oh, we got the arrows too. Okay. The bell and the pitcher. There's the pitcher. And a five dollar win is looking a little bit spicy. But uh, the bell is the bell is kind of low. The bar is set kind of low today with a ten dollar spin. So the drum and the watermelon told us eat. Ah, uh, and there's the five dollar win. But you can win more than once on a ticket. Five dollars right down the row. You can win more than once on a ticket. And we still got three more symbols left. So that's kind of exciting. I've never won a two dollar and a five dollar before. Oh, we could still we could still win the rooster and the hand, which would give us ten thousand. Anything's possible. And there's the hand. And what's the other one? The cactus. No, I don't have that. But we still have a bonus collar card. And it's the man. <laughs> it's like they were so creative with the name. Literally, is it the man or the musician? No, on the new one it says the man. I think. Um, no musician, but it's a $5 win right there. Um, so that's good. That's half our money back. I'll take it. I'll take it. We have gotten back-to-back -back before on Lotteria. That was fun. I'm going to walk away for a moment and get my other glasses. That's how you know you're old. You have multiple pairs of glasses. You're like, no, I need the better glasses. No, I need the reading glasses. No, I need the bifocal glasses. I need the older glasses. Do any of you all ever do that? You need the older glasses because the older glasses were better. Why does it seem to change on the daily? I don't know. All right, let's try. I'm gonna use the other scratcher this time. Oh, I'm just feeling spicy. Okay. The ladder. Oh, and right off the bat, the ladder's there. The parrot and the mermaid. The mermaid's there. Hey, lady. How you doing? I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm terrible at that. I'm not good at that. Okay, that's good. We've got the deer, oh dear, and the flower pot. Neither one but the musician showed up, right? Darn musician. We've got the drum and the fish. Oh, the fish is there. Barrel. No drum. No drum, though. Okay. The star and the sun. Right next to each other. Look at that. That's kind of cool. That would be sweet. The canoe and the bell. I really like the lottery tickets. I'd really like to get a nice win. The claimer would be fun. The world and the arrows. Okay. I don't think I've missed anything. I think I'm doing pretty good. I think the iPad helps me. With, with keeping up, making sure I get everything I'm supposed to get because it's bigger. <laughs> bigger is better. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. <laughs> you know what they say about big feet? Big socks. That's <laughs> when well, y'all are like, wow, she's losing it. That hurricane just sucked it right out of her head. Um, no rose. Darn, we were so close. We were close there. We we're close here. Here. Man. <sighs> I feel ripped off. But I don't see anything. And of course, you guys know, if later when I scan the tickets, because I scan after every single session, people get so worried. I'm like, no, I always scan. No worries. Um, I will post a horrible update in the middle of the video. If you've never seen one, they're super fun. Not the terrible, the terrible edit. But I do that because you guys get concerned. You're like, oh my God, she threw away $50,000. No, I didn't. I didn't. I promise you. Watermelon toilet seat and the boot. No boot. The bell and oh dear. Oh dear. And the bell. 
You can ring my bell. It's a terrible singing. Uh, oh, the musician shows up and the cactus. It's, we needed you on the other ticket, sir. No cactus, though. We've got the flower pot and the rose, but no cactus. The ladder and the rooster. <laughs> he sounds a bit. Did y'all used to do that when you kids? You do. Am I the only one? I could be. Y'all are like, man, she is weirder than we thought. My husband and I joke all the time when we're in the car, because I'm this weird pretty much all the time. The pear and the star. I said, my God, could you imagine like a road trip with Grandma Scratcher? People would be like, man, she's crazier than we thought. He goes, yeah, I know. <laughs> in case you're wondering, am I like this all the time? Pretty much. I'm a lot. I'm a lot. A barrel and the parrot. The parrot's showing up a lot, but he's not on here. No bear, ooh, but look at that spicy. Man, the umbrella would be sweet right now, right? The pitcher and the frog. Look at the pitcher. Look at the frog. Okay, so where are we? We could use the umbrella. We could use the mermaid. We could use the tree. We could use the world. Man, look at how many winds are possible right now. One, how many? Let's count them all. Well, one, two, two, three, three. Three licks to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop. No. One, two, three. <laughs> it was. It was three. Oh, four. Four wins. All right. See, we just need one of those four symbols. Come on, Florida Lottery. Give us something good. The moon. Psh, that's not what we asked for. That's not what we asked for. Darn it. Darn them. All right. Last. No, not last ticket. Man, she can't even count to four, Bob. <sighs> it's okay. I'm just, I'm having a good time. Hanging out with you. Hanging out with you, my boo. You will always be my boo. Now, we don't usually participate in gossip, okay? But I gotta tell you guys something. For those of you who watched the whole video, you're getting gems today. No, I'm just kidding. So, we were watching the other night. I It's been so stressful lately that when we sit down to eat dinner, my husband and I, we always watch a movie. We always just put a movie on. And, um, and we don't eat the table, but we sit down and watch a movie in the living room. And uh, yesterday he goes, well, let's watch Meatballs. And I'm like, Pfft. I've, I've heard of it. I've never seen it, but okay. So we put on meatballs and then my brain starts wandering. My brain clicks along at its own speed. And I'm like, Bill Murray, has he ever been married? Has he ever had kids? And so I, I Google it. He has sons, five or six sons. He's been married twice, but you guys will never guess who he's currently linked with in the media. Hasn't come out with an official statement, but you would never guess. And sadly, I can't tell you her name, but you're gonna know who she is. You're gonna know. Because I'm like, oh, it's, it's a one word name. And I'm like, hmm, interesting. Okay, lovely, lovely woman. And I'm like, why is she so famous? Like, who is she? She's going by one name. Certainly, I should know what she's done. Oh yes, we all know what she's done. The lady that Bill Murray is currently dating according to sources is, my milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. My, my what is better than yours, mm-hmm. That Bill Murray, Bill Murray, that's who he's dating. I kid you not. Google it. Have a good time with that. I always find it interesting to watch who's dating who in the celebrity world. And it's my favorite thing to do with my husband. Somebody will come on the screen. I'll go, you do, I bet you don't know who they're married to. He's like, who? And I tell him, he's like, how do you know that? It's like, I, well, they called me Monday. I'm like, no. Just, I just, it, the information, I just see it and it sinks in. We got a frog and we got a watermelon toilet seat. Now I want to eat watermelon, but there's no watermelon toilet seat. The barrel and the cello. Cello, baby. Neither one of those. That's stinky. The flower pot and the sun. Black hole sun. We've got the flower pot, but no... Oh, the sun is. It's right there in the corner. Hiding out in the corner, man. Standing on the corner, waiting in the rain. I swear I'll never, ever... Wait again. And the tree. You're like, man, she's coming up with some stuff we haven't heard yet. I know. Because sometimes I don't know all the words. And that's embarrassing. The boot and the rose. That's a joke we say in the car all the time. We'll be going along. My husband is one of those people who sings, even though he doesn't know the words. Not that I know the words, but I look at him and I go, hey, who sings this song? And he'll tell me. And I go, you should let them sing it. <laughs> He puts up with me, but I put up with him too. The crown and the ladder. Y'all are like, she's a lovely person. My husband's like, no, 
She is not. <laughs> All right, what would be fun is getting the pair. We would get the $2, but then we get five. What'd you win? $502. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> we watched that guy on TikTok. What is it? It's a mermaid. It's not even on the ticket. You don't even go here. Okay, so nothing. So we're still stuck with the one win. Oh, what were the odds? Oh, I'm so sorry. I usually show the odds. One in every 4.63. All right, well, I'm still hoping for another win. A profit session would be fabulous. I'd love a claimer. Like any of those, Florida Lottery, that'd be a wonderful. Be wonderful. The drum and the cactus. I want one of those tickets where you just scratch off. It's like, oh yeah, boom, 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 boom. That's what I want to do. The sun and the fish. I still don't understand why the sun looks different down here than it looks here. Like, well, I would like answers to that. Like, why would you do that? I, I, it's not even that I think. I know. They purposely do stuff to mess people up so they think they haven't won. I know they do. It's like their private game that they're playing. Not even like at the casino where they have to be fair. It's, you know, the frog, new frog. Okay, but we still got spicy stuff going on. $5 there, $100, oh, that would be fun, $100 win. Let's do that. The umbrella and the canoe. There's no canoe. The moon and the pitcher. I'm like looking around the peripherals. No. Not the pet. Why the pair? The parrot has shown up a million times. The parrot and the barrel. None of that. Okay, so we could use a ladder. We could use a mermaid. We could use a crown. Right? Ladder, mermaid, crown. We got the hand. Yeah, we got the hand right to the face. They're like smack. Nothing. We told you no more. No more. All right. So on a $10 spend, we got a $5 win. That's not bad. 50% back. That was fun. Haven't done these tickets in forever, but I had a good time. And I really hope that you had a good time. If you're not a subscriber yet, do me a favor, like the video, subscribe, give it a thumbs up, ring the bell, scream it from the rooftops, tell all your besties. Um, tell all the frogs in your backyard due to the flooding. How do I know about these things? Oh, don't make me talk about it. Anyways, all those things are free to do. They help the channel out. You can also hop over to grandmascratcher.com, sign up for the free newsletter. No worries of spam. I'm not, I haven't sent anything out yet. Um, and I really appreciate it. I appreciate everything you guys do for the channel. Um, but before we go, we got to do it. Got to come up with something good going on. My good thing today is kind of random. It's the color teal. Have you ever noticed how like the color teal just makes you feel happy? It makes you feel kind of beachy, like, like beachy, like there's waves and there's, is it just me or does teal? Teal just makes me happy. Purple makes me happy, but teal makes me happier. Which is, then why is purple my favorite color? I don't know, but that's not the point. I think maybe, well, I look good in purple. I look good in teal too. I don't, this has gone not where I wanted it to go. Anyways, the color teal is my good thing for the day. It just makes me smile. We've got to focus on the good stuff because what we focus on multiplies. We could all use a little more good in the world. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you guys next time.